Okay, guys, I hope everybody is taking care and being blessed today. I just wanted to come on today because you guys know I've been going through a few tooth pain uh, last year. Um, I was out of tooth pain, but then I wind up going to my dentist and they wind up fixing a uh, cavity that the filling came out. And he looked on the x-ray. He was like, well, I see the other side needs to be filled. Why did I let him do that? I know that happened. This is the third time that happened. Every time he fixed one other thing that I have no problems with, it always starts something. So now my tooth that he filled on the other side that I wasn't having problems with is giving me so many problems. If it hit cold, hot, everything, it hurts so bad. I have been back to him so many times, guys. So I decided to take it into my own hands um this is a, just a quick fix guys i'm trying to figure out what i'm gonna do in regards to it but the more you do this the more it may possibly do better um what you need to use is because you know tooth pain is no pump you can either use advil you can use a regular advil which is really good I only take one um then this is when you have a throbbing pain because sometimes you have tooth pain without the throb but if it has a throb this is good too this is a new um advil dual action you can use that for pain. And another thing that I also use is I gargle with warm salt water. So get a cup, fill it probably about like this, and maybe about a teaspoon of salt. Stir it all together. Make sure it's warm because if it's cold, or um, it can tend to make your teeth hurt even more. So always make sure you're mindful of that. When you have a tooth pain, you never realize what's hot and cold. But make sure it's try to do things. Even sometimes room temperature is hot. You just see which one works for you but always make sure you use warm water and like i said i was just use about this much water and that will work in a teaspoon of salt and gargle especially make sure you hit the areas where it really hurts at that works perfect another thing that is so excellent on teeth right here um, especially in the middle of the night if you are going through a lot of pain this right here you can get it from amazon that is where i get it from and you can also sometimes find it at walgreens um, this tooth pain, again, is called Red Cross Toothache. Get rid of, rid of the throbbing and everything. It's so good. Um, another thing is if you want to use the hydroperoxide, it's perfect. You do a good rinse with the hydroperoxide, and then you follow it up with the baking soda. Um, what I like to do is either I put the baking soda on my um, toothbrush, and I like brush my teeth with it being on. I do it everywhere, like all over. But I really, when I'm doing the uh, hydroperoxide, I'm really focusing this on, I'm sorry, the main area that is really hurting, but I'm doing everything. So do your whole teeth, uh, whole mouth. Uh, do a good rinse, just like you will rinse with the uh, uh, salt water do not um swallow this do just do a good rinse and then what i like to do also this baking soda is the bomb so if you have tooth pain in the middle of the night i'm telling you all you got to do is put some baking soda on your hand um wet it and just put it all on your gums and where the area is really hurting if you want you can do the whole thing and i'm telling you it will stop throbbing like soon again these are just uh, ways that you can be able to get rid of your pain because I don't know if about you but if you ever had a tooth pain it ain't no pun and I figure if I can share that with you guys um, I will come to you guys if you can go to the dentist that was our some remedies let me know in the video description box what you use don't forget to rate comment and subscribe you guys take care be blessed and I chat with you guys later bye guys